Hey guys, it's Stephanie Dees here with StephanieDeesStamps.com. I just wanted to come on right quick and show you guys the um, November Paper Pumpkin. I got mine in uh, actually yesterday, Saturday, November the 18th. Um, but I just wanted to pop on here right quick and show you guys um, the, sorry, I'm just adjusting, the um, November Paper Pumpkin. I get a couple because I love them so much. <laughs> Right? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. It's a paid subscription. Um, you get uh, one per month for $19 a month. You can subscribe and cancel at any time. But um, last month's with Pining for Plaid, which was a beautiful, and these two are actually coordinating. So this was last, last month's, and it was some Christmas um, cards. And so this is this month. So let's see what we've got. Christmas cheer you'll want to share. That's here on the top of the box. And skip to the fun. Don't forget to peek below. Okay, let's see what we've got. Um, can you see that? There's Let It Snow. Mary and Bride. I love that. Uh, two from. Okay, so it's maybe, and there's Joy. Maybe some tags. There's a Christmas tree, snowflake, a star, and two leaves or branch branches and leaves elements. So you guys see that? Um, so every month these come with the stamp, and the stamping spot is Dapper Denim. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see this. So let's see what we got. <gasps> no way! Look at this. Oh my goodness. Okay. 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 Gotta hurry, gotta hurry. This is absolutely beautiful. And you know those boxes can be used as gift boxes? Look, stockings. Back in plaid is what the uh, project is called. <gasps> oh my gosh, look at that, holy cow. All right, let's break it open. This is gorgeous, oh my gosh. This is probably gonna sell out very fast. So you had to be uh, subscribed by the 10th of the month to get um, the paper pumpkin. I have two extras. I absolutely adore them. I share. I do, I promise. Um, if anyone is really dying to have one, let me know. Um, look at these tags. Those are plain tags and these are um, tags with uh, gold foil. So snowflakes and trees. I know, I'm gonna make you wait until the end to see them. And here's more of the um, leaves. These are punch outs or uh, die cuts. So you can see these. So that's the leaves. And here is another, oh, these are red. Those others were white. Yeah, plain white and red, white on the other side. So these punch out as well, they're die cut for you. So all the work and all the designs um, done for you so it's very easy very simple these make perfect gifts for for people that either don't have a lot of space or a lot of time to do crafts and um, but they love it so that's the extra board and it has um, the glue dots <clears throat> so and here's the instructions so let's see what we've got this one is showing it folded down so this one they already folded down for you uh, these are not folded down so you've got one two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten of them. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Wait a minute. That one's okay. Hang on. Give me a second. Okay. So, okay. Okay. I got you. So with, uh, with these, you have to turn them inside outward. So let's, um, yeah, these you have to turn inside outward. <clears throat> easy peasy if you're a sewer. Um, if you're not, it's very easy. And you may want to actually um, iron them to get them to um, stay straight or uh, flatten out maybe. Uh, I'm an ironer, so that's a big pet peeve of mine is things that aren't straight. But it looks like these will be just fine without it. 
and how you get that seam out is put it between your fingers and you wiggle 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 like that I love to uh, <laughs> say that word evidently wiggle wiggle there's a heel that can be pushed out some more wiggle 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 to get that seam out and even you just putting it your fingers around it like this and just pinching or pressing the heat from your hands and your fingers will definitely open that seam up and help it stay okay so there is the little stocking and then you you tuck it down and so there you go that's it so oh my gosh and then you just make the labels and then you put whatever you need in it in that cute and you have the little clothes pins to go with it oh my gosh this is the cutest thing ever so yeah awesome and they've got the denim so you put the let it snow let it snow let it snow or merry and bright merry and bright oh this is just gorgeous so anyway that is the uh, January uh, November paper pumpkin and it is just awesome and to die for I think that it's just absolutely gorgeous I think I'll just have to put do one right quick I've got a smidgen of time so I'm going to do I'm sorry but I'm a Christmas tree fan so I'm gonna do the Christmas tree and it's gonna be I'm gonna do the merry and bright okay so I'm gonna set that off to the side this one's gonna be the merry and bright when you get your first paper pumpkin you're gonna get a D block this one is not the one that comes in it, <clears throat> but uh, you'll get one very similar in, to size and everything for that. So here we're going to do Merry and Bright. And we're gonna open our, take my snips and open the stampin' spot that comes with it. Uh-oh, there's a, piece of thread on that one so ink it up really good I take my ink spot to my um, stamp that is mounted that way it's very easy to get it and I'm a little overzealous when it comes to that so merry and bright and it is going to just go right off the there we go gorgeous so then I'm going to pair it with the red and you want just a little tail there. So we're going to get the stampin or the not the stampin spot but the um, glue dot and we're going to have it offset just a little bit. And so here this is and then we'll put some leaves up under it. How easy is this one? You want leaves on top if you want leaves on the bottom and also do the bow oh my gosh this is the simplest and cutest little craft I mean this one reminds me of the Easter one that they did this year I think they have definitely outdone themselves with this and I'm so stinking happy that it is a uh, stocking totally okay so I'm having a little bit of trouble with my bow pull it out and then I want to shorten my bow actually to be a little bit smaller than that and then I'm going to clip it to be what I want it to be and then I'll take the glue dot use the scissors to help me out here you know I don't really have to buy glue dots because of all the glue dots that come with the projects uh, so really when you get these when you get the subscription, when you subscribe, you get practically anything you need. And there's my finished product. I love it. So thank you guys for stopping by and watching. I'll have this on YouTube, on my Facebook uh, page, as well as on um, the website, uh, stephaniedstamps.com. Thank you. You guys take care.